So you're asking 70, would you take 50? Hey guys, it's Nando, the Tattooed Reseller, and with me today I got my beautiful daughter, Layla! Hello! And we're gonna clean up the garage sales! Tag along! Good morning. Oh. What are you asking for this, sir? What's that, Daddy? Three? You got a deal. Here you go, sweetheart. All right. You have a wonderful day. You too. Good morning. Could you do 10? Uh, oh, I'm sorry. It was 15. Was it? What is it? Oh, yeah, it was 15. It fell off. Okay, yeah. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. No. How much for the floor mats? Uh, sure. Alright, I got a pair of shoes and a floor mats. Okay. Thank y'all so much. Best of luck with your sale. Hello. Hi. How are you? Good. Yeah, she probably won't. I know. She's a night owl like her mama. I might be Hey, it's my turn to buy though. No, it's not. Hey, give me one too. You want a lemonade or no? Yeah? I'll get it. It's Alright, uh, so that'll be three lemonades. It's later right now. There you go. You, she can keep that. For what? For the three lemonades. $10? Yeah. They're only 50 cents. I know. Okay, Gracie. Thank you. Good morning. Hmm? How much is your uh, sweater over here? The little gray one. A dollar. Okay. We're going to spring fest Thank tonight. You. Thank you. So, Sensi, Sensi sells. Oh, Sensi did sell. Very, it sells, sells very much so. $2.00. But this thing only sells for 50 bucks. And Okay, so uh, I got 15 and she's got um, $2.50. Thank you. Thanks, sweetheart. Thank you. Hang on a minute. Good morning. Yeah. Okay, wonderful. How much for the dog? <laughs> oh, dang it. He's living on hello. Look. What are you asking for this little Jenny? smart gear? Uh, Two dollars? Deal. You're going to hate that thing whenever you use it. Oh, yeah? It's going to tell you when you drop. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that'll be between me and it, won't it? Yeah. <laughs> Hello, you little welcome committee. Look at you, you little greeter. Oh, you're so sweet. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Good morning. Thank you. Dad, how much were the end papers on the end? Problem. Well, 
Yeah, thank you. Let me look, yeah, I don't know. A dollar? I'll take it for a dollar. Is that a yeah, dollar? Yes, I think thank so. you so much. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you for coming by. Thank you for having it. Anything you're interested in? Yeah, I kind of thinking about these. Just not a, not a hundred percent sure yet. I'll make a deal for you, two dollars. <laughs> Okay. Deal. Deal. All right. Deal. All right. Uh, All right. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Sure. Five dollars. Work. Uh, as far as I know, it did. When Thank we you. Quit using it. Okay. One of the S. A cuánto? Hey guys, we're back! It's time for the joke of the day! Really? How do you fix a cracked pumpkin? <laughs> I don't know. How do you fix a cracked pumpkin? With a pumpkin patch. <laughs> I love it. What are you asking for this, ma'am? They just fold and snap on to get together. They, they collapse. Can you just open them up? Sir? Sure. Snap down. Okay. I'm just not going to snap them down a little bit, but they do. They just snap. 100 bucks, huh? Oh, okay. They're 15 each? Yeah, they're 15 each, or I can give you both for 20. Mm. I don't want to insult you. <laughs> <laughs> Take 20. Twenty-five. I appreciate it. So you're asking 70, would you take 50? So we're at 75 then. I appreciate y'all working with me. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I appreciate you working with me, sir. Thank you. Those are hard you have a wonderful day. You too. How are y'all today? Good. Okay. And then these are Steelers things. My son's a Steelers fan. Oh, is he? Oh, yeah. Hmm. Big time. He even has a tattoo. No. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> what are you asking for this vest, though? That? Um, oh, I think I had how about five bucks. Okay. Does that sound all right? It doesn't sound bad at all. Okay. Just it's reversible. What brand is it though? Oh. 
Would you do five for this jacket also if I take uh, this vest? If you take two of them for 10 bucks, you bet. All right, thank you, sweetheart. I appreciate it. Thank right. you so much. You bet. You have a wonderful day. You too. Hey guys, so we're back from that garage sale haul and uh, sorry it's a little late in the afternoon. I had to help and set up the Halloween decorations. Let me show you guys what my house looks like now. All right, so we got the giant spider web and I got the man-eating spider right there. We got this little ghost here that goes from tree to tree. He, he literally just slides up and down whenever he's activated. Real neat. We got our two porch skeletons here. Uh, we actually dressed this guy up as Sam. My daughter was Sam last year and you know, just we just kept the costume and we dressed him up. And I just bought him at the garage sale today. So he's already assuming his post and doing his duty. And then we have the, uh, the spider web over the welcome sign. We replaced the floor mat. Yeah, we're recording. Uh, yeah, it's recording. And then we have the uh, the wreath or the re whatever you want to call it. We've got some tombstones. This thing's real neat. Let me see if I can turn it on. <laughs> That's pretty cool. It's like motion and sound activated. So it, pretty cool. Pretty cool. It scares the crap out of people that don't know any better. So we kind of do get into Halloween a lot. Uh, it's this area. On um, that day, it's like filled with kids, and I usually just stand right here with a little table and my Bluetooth speaker, listening to Halloween music as I'm giving candy. And I sometimes dress up too, just you know, just keep it going. But anyway, enough about that. It's time for the top three finds of the day. All right, so the first item are these Sorrel boots. Now, I immediately saw it from when I got out of the car because they have a very unique look. And at first I thought they were L.L. Bean boots, but no, they're Sorrel, which is a very good brand still. And these are size 12. Now, guys, when I mean these things are pristine, they are pristine. Excellent condition. I don't think they've ever been worn. I seriously think they're new. And I'm going to look at them a little bit more closely, but I swear I think they're new. I don't think they were ever worn. Uh, if they were, maybe one, can, one time. But I'm going to clean them up as best as I can and hopefully I can list them as new if not obviously used but I can still get some good money for them. I paid $20 for these and if they are in new condition I can definitely get a hundred bucks for them which I think I can just because of the condition that they're in. I think I can get a hundred bucks. Now find number two. All right, now this is a Honeywell. Um, uh, I think this is some kind of alarm system. Now guys, I was driving and at first I, I almost passed up the garage sale. I was driving and I didn't, it looked like a little table. I didn't think much of it until I saw Honeywell. If you see Honeywell, look it up. There's a reason why in England they say honey is money. The gentleman said, make me an offer. I told him, I don't want to insult you because I had just looked it up and I saw it was selling for about a hundred bucks. He said, I paid a hundred dollars for it brand new and I never used it. So I, I wanted to make as much money as possible. So I said, I don't want to insult you. And he said, you can't tell me what you're offering. So I said, 20 bucks. And he said, 25. I'm not going to argue over five bucks. Guys, this is a hundred dollar item. So I jumped all over it. I said, yeah, I'll, I'll take it for 25. And I just so happened to walk over and da 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 The fight of the day! This guy was on that same table. Look, it still has, I still have the, the post enough for 70 bucks. And I looked it up. This is a $180 item. And so I immediately put on my poker face and guys, rule number one in life, if you don't ask, you'll never know. So I just asked, I have it marked for 70, would you accept 50? It was towards the end of the day, it was around 11.30 and it hadn't sold, so obviously I think they understood that the, it was priced a little too high. So when I offered 50, I'm willing to give them 50 right now, they took it. The gentleman said, yeah, sure, no problem. So I paid $50 for this item. Guys, again, this is a $180 item. So I paid 75 for both of these. 
and I think I can get about a hundred dollars for this and definitely at 160 to 180 for this item overall it was a great great haul on a side note let me show you guys an item that almost took the place of the Sorel boots and it is this little camera right here this little Canon Telemax I paid a dollar for it and this is an $80 camera so if I can't list these boots as brand new then this camera takes the place of it <laughs> so I just gotta I just gotta make sure it works which I haven't done yet I'll let you know but that is it for this video you guys thank you so much for watching if you'd be so kind enough to hit that like and subscribe for me I would greatly appreciate it it would help this channel out a ton and here's your daily reminder that you look great bye <laughs>